Hi guys, this is Nika and I am pleasantly unbothered. Thank you so much for joining me for yet another video. Today we are back inside the dressing room at Torrid. I wanted to check out some of the styles that they have in store these days and I found so many cute things. Oh my gosh, and I had such a good time getting all dressed up and trying everything on. So let me know what you think, of course, of the items that I try. Let me know what your favorite pieces are. Uh, this day I had so many favorites, but if I'm being honest, I actually didn't make any purchases because I forgot my coupons at home. So since the prices are just a bit too steep for me to shop without a coupon, what I'm going to do is just get my items online. That way I can use my coupon and also use Ebates to get some extra cash back. So win-win. And if you ever want to check out Ebates, there's actually a link below that can get you a free $10 bonus when you sign up for free. And I did notice that there is a sale on Torrid's website right now. I believe it's 25% off. And so, you know, you can save some extra money, girl. Hello. Oh, and it seems like online they carry sizes 00 to size 6, which is equivalent to a size 10 up to a size 30. And in store, I've seen the sizes double zero to a size four, which I believe is a 10 to a 26. So there's a lot of variety. And of course, if you end up liking this video, hit that thumbs up button and please do leave me a comment. Let me know what you liked. And if you enjoy videos like these, please consider subscribing. All right, so we'll ease right into it with this blouse. This one is in a size two, and just so you know, all sizes and prices and links that I could find are in the description box below, so be sure to check that out. This top does have functional pockets as well as buttons at the bust, and the sleeves are about a three quarter length, which I thought was perfect for like the summer and easing into the fall. And the color is so cute, and now that I think of it, I might as well warn you now that you are gonna see a lot of this color, but it's just so pretty. So I hope you don't mind. And I totally didn't even <laughs> realize until I was watching this footage back that I guess I'm obsessed with this shade. All right then. Next up, we have this combo, which includes a regular old V-neck tee on top. This one has a feather print on it and it's covered in like mauve and gray feathers and it's so cute up close. Look at that, look at it. It does have that little pocket and it is slightly see-through, but nice and soft and comfortable. And then on the bottom, this skirt though this skirt though okay so it is striped and it is somewhat sheer on the top layer but it does have an additional layer underneath and it was just so cute my only issue with the skirt is that it was kind of crinkled as you can see along the front there so it the shape just didn't lay the way it should have and perhaps with I don't know some straightening out it might be better but so cute hello okay and next up, this is the top that I actually picked up the skirt to pair with in the first place. And you can see why. I mean, look at this. Look at this. Okay, I'm so excited about this outfit right here. And this is one that I rushed home to order. But it looks like this top is sold out online. So I will be going back to that store and getting this top if they still have it. It looks like a basic tank top with a nice print. But then along the neckline, it has a caged type of detail. And it is so cute. So cute. Look at those colors. And I did forget to pull the tank top out so that you can see how it flows. But it does flow similar to this next one. Nice and flowy. I guess I just said flow a lot but anyway this pattern here is of course a floral print so it's a bit different than the last but still a very vibrant type of tank top it has the faux lace-up detail there at the neckline and again nice and long and flowy and lightweight perfect for the season next I threw on this anorak in a camo print it was so comfortable and I just love the way it fit. 
of course you can use the strings there to adjust the definition at the waistline you know to your liking and it has those deep pockets again which i love just so functional and the patches on the arm just make it look so like rocker badass i just loved it just loved it but um this one was like $68 and so that's what I mean about shopping at Torrid without my coupon. It just was not going to happen. Next we have this very cute dress. It does have a cold shoulder as well as a very interesting print. The waist is defined there by that little cinch but it is not very stretchy so I did have a hard time getting it over the boobies just saying and then there is a slight bell sleeve and while I thought that all of those details were very cute it just didn't come together for me I didn't love it but I did think it was a really really pretty dress really pretty just maybe not my style I don't know but size 2 everything's been in a size 2 so far and next up this beautiful floral dress and I think for me the key to florals is that it be on a darker background like black and this one I just thought was so pretty again cold shoulder a slight flowy bell sleeve again cinched at the waist there but again not very stretchy so the boobs uh, they're sucked in there guys they're sucked in there <laughs> And um, this one has a high-low thing happening at the bottom. So in the front, it is higher. In the back, it is lower. And still very cute, very flowy. Felt like I should go to a garden party or something wearing this dress. Very nice. Oh, and another cute detail is that at the shoulder, you can actually tie the straps there to adjust where that falls on you so depending on your height or the length of your torso that might be a cute little detail and a cool little feature to have real cute and i'm actually surprised at how many dresses i reached for considering years ago you cannot get me to even look at a dress are you kidding me but now here we have another dress and another floral print and another bright color which again was a no-no years ago anyway who am i anyway anyway <laughs> um so this one is again very cute very flowy has the flared sleeve which can be very flattering and comfortable to wear especially if you prefer to have your arms covered then we have the slip underneath and the nice skater style flared skirt <laughs> why am i dancing i don't know but so so cute again a size two and this is one that i felt like i loved it but i don't know that my life really suits it like i don't know that i have anywhere to wear this to it's just so pretty but that's not my life you know you ever feel that way i don't know let me know let me know what you think <laughs> And here's the back. It does have like a lace up back. And I thought that could be so cute. And it comes down to a really nice length as well. Next up, we have a maxi dress. This one is sleeveless. It does have a bit of a lace trim going along the bottom. And a little bit of lace at the bust area as well. Again, it does have that cinch at the waistline, but again, not very stretchy. So it's gonna hold you in there. Make sure you get your size. This one is, is, is in a size two. <laughs> and for some of these items, I probably could have gone up to a size three, but it just depends on the way you like your clothes to fit. In this case, I love how flowy the bottom was. It just makes you feel like a goddess a goddess when it just barely drapes to the ground as you walk and flows i'm just saying you know what i mean you know what i'm talking about so cute and again this color this color i can't get enough all right so we're switching things up a little bit for the next outfit here we have a white military jacket well actually it's more like a cream or off-white and on bottom it's a leopard print or cheetah print leopard print whichever one <laughs> tool skirt that's very full and it's about a midi length 
and it has a ton of layers under there so there's that top layer with the pattern and it is see-through as you can see then a very silky satiny type of layer followed by a bunch of tulle and then another layer at the bottom to protect your legs very very full and it just called out to me for some reason so i had to try it on you know what that's like and then on top this jacket that i am obsessed with it is a fitted military jacket but it is somewhat cropped it has the buttons going along the front and if you can see the material it looks kind of like a jersey knit and it's so soft and so comfortable obviously the clasps look like they're struggling a little bit along my bust just saying i got a lot there <laughs> and i probably could size up well i probably should size up in this one if i were to purchase it i probably would unless i planned on wearing it open because i do like the way that the shoulders and the sleeves on this one fit and so as you can see open it does not look like a struggle in the clothes and it lays all nice and cute and stuff i can create so many different outfits with this jacket Ugh, I'm so in love. This jacket is definitely one of my favorites from this entire try-on, and I'm curious to know what you think. Do you love it as much as I do? I love it so much, so much, and I'm so excited that fall is around the corner, because then the weather will actually be perfect for things like this. Ooh, I can't wait and here we have another jacket that I loved this one is a denim moto jacket it's in this kind of off black shade and this one is also in a size 2 now if you can see the pockets there the zippered pockets which I thought were very cute they fall actually like at my side which means that they're under like my armpit <laughs> and so on this one I would definitely have to size up to a size 3 so that it could wrap around me and actually close and fit properly next up we have another jacket this one is in this beautiful satin pinky mauve tone and it has the embroidered floral print going down the front on both sides as you can see it is slightly shiny against these bright lights so if that's a look that you like it is so cute and it felt so smooth to the touch like i just wanted to keep running my fingers over it it was so nice so nice the original price on this one though is $78.90 so with my budget I would have to catch this on like a mega super duper sale and with a coupate, coupate, <laughs> a coupon and while using Ebates that's what I was trying to say <laughs> in order to justify buying that one but very cute though and next up we have another dress this one is more of a shift dress than a skater dress so there's not as much flair to it but it is very cute also it is in a faux wrap style so it's meant to look as if one side wraps around the other and ties at the waist where that tie gives you some definition at the waistline and the front dips down into a nice low v-neck so obviously my bra is showing so you'd want to make sure that you got something real appropriate underneath or just let the girl show i don't know what your style is but either way i wasn't in love with it but depending on your style and your shape i think it's a beautiful dress and i actually feel like i've seen a similar dress before but it had little lipsticks all over it instead so it's really reminiscent of something like that and last up we have this olive top it's very similar to the first one that I tried on with the buttons down the front and the three-quarter length sleeve also the top does come to a nice length and this one was just a bit more snug than the first one so I'd probably go with a size 3 on this if I were to make this purchase I guess this top doesn't really compare to some of the other items I tried on so I don't know don't forget to let me know what you think in the comment section below also if you like this video so far go ahead and hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe I mean these videos I mean don't you love them I love that you watch them thank you <laughs> and last but not least we have my outfit of the day today was an office day and this was my look 
I'm wearing this cute peplum top from Fashion to Figure in a beautiful color. Also some basic black slacks and some black toms on the feet. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do be sure to stay tuned for future videos, including more try-ons and my first lookbook and much more. So I hope to see you in my next one. Bye.